Hi guys, I am back and today I'm in Primark. I'm going to show you around all of the new in bits in Primark Oxford Street. There's so much in this Oxford Circus store, so let's get going. Wanna make things right. Okay, so I've literally got the hugest bag to fill. Um, I feel like it's going to be really easy to do because there's so many nice things in. Okay, this blazer is definitely giving me Zara-esque. I'm loving all of the browns. I think that would be a big trend again for this season. These boots. <gasps> Look at this. Mm. That is really nice. Let's try on already. I love this. I don't know if I'm expecting like too oversized. But I've obviously got it on with this outfit that I'm wearing today for shopping. This is so cheap though. No, this is a 16 but I'm going to try the 14 because it's a bit too big here. The 14 so it's not going in the basket because the 16 is too big but anybody else likes it. It is £18 and the code is... This is really cute as well. This brown gilet. I feel like they're going to be massive this season. Really nice mum jeans. Nice jackets come in, white t-shirts. This camel coat is beautiful. It literally looks like the Zara one I got last year. We've got some accessories, loving the scarves. I just ordered one really similar from H&M and Zara. Um, and now I'm gutted because I should have just waited and come to Primark perhaps. I'm literally loving all of the displays. These like tones of earthy tones all together. And stripes, I'm seeing loads of stripes in H&M and Zara. Oh my god, look at these come to go on. Love Primark. You want it, they get it. <laughs> I've been watching a lot of um, what's coming in for autumn and loads of American channels call these vests. But I would call it a waistcoat. So waistcoats and vests are going to be huge again for this season, which I'm really excited about because I love these kind of things. They're not the most flattering. Um, to go for a more tailored one but I'm just loving all this autumn stuff oh the zip up as well this is something that I'm trying to get I want one that's not got a drop sleeve I saw one last year I wish I'd got it in a stripe that didn't have a drop sleeve because I just feel like this is just so unflattering whereas if it's on the shoulder it's just so much more flattering but I'm loving up this trend of the zip half up zip back in for this autumn this one is really cute but again drop sleeve so it's not going to be the most flattering um, and then this is the code if anybody is looking for one of these it's actually really good quality compared to some of the other ones I've seen £14 bargain again they have smashed it with the dupes this is an Air Force One dupe if you've been trying to get Air Force Ones like me from JD, they are constantly sold out. So Primark have just solved the problem and created their own. This is literally the exact same as the Zara one that I showed you guys last year. And this bodysuit is more or less identical to one that we're bringing out for your lifestyle. So this section looks like it's more of like what's on trend um, and a bit younger with all the check shirts and patterns and stuff. But I just love how they've put it all together. Like I said, this store is absolutely humongous. <laughs> so they've actually got room to present things nicely. Oh my God, these boots, look at these. <gasps> I am so tempted, they are beautiful. This is cool. It looks like a check shirt that's ruched. I might have to try that, that looks really nice. It is 11 pounds, size 14. In. They are different. Padded shorts. I've somehow made it to the underwear section and it is crazy the dupes we are seeing guys there is skims dupes lounge dupes you name it if you want a bargain Primark I've got the dupes and the pants the trusted pants that I love so much are back here they are 
six pounds, pack of three. And they've also got this new design look, blue, with this like rib. I think they've got to go in the basket. We've also got some autumn matching sets going off, which I love. A brown set and get it more tonal nudes, this kind of like off greeny grey, which is really nice. Got some mini Uggs in Primark. Love. More colours? Yes, they have the actual colours that we want as well. Oh my gosh, what don't they have? I've been on my friend face. <laughs> like, I'm not ready for that, thank you. Um, we are now in the home section. There's loads of nice little bits. But I've just got to remember that I can't carry everything because I've always got to get the train back to Leeds from London. Or I would go absolutely mad. There's so many nice bits. I just love all this weird abstractness that's happening right now in the, in the um, interior world. Um, we got, yeah, just a lot of weird abstract prints, shapes. Also, we went past this section. We've been talking, so I have missed a bit of a section out because we've been chatting and catching up. But this section, the Primark Wellness, is a bit more of their sustainable range as well, which I love. And these sets are so nice. This one especially. I'm very, very tempted to put this in my basket, but I don't need it. <laughs> this one, how much are we? Seven pounds for this really beautiful set in this oatmeal colour. Got it in white, pink. And this lovely blue shade as well coming through. These are all like really neutral tones, aren't they? Of like earth, earthy tones. Clean. Clean girl aesthetic, I guess. Hoodie, this one's really nice. It's a set, these baskets, everything. It's just vibey. Hey guys, I am now back from London, back at home. And I wanted to take you in the changing rooms with me, but it was honestly one of the hottest days I've ever experienced in London. It, it was so hot in there that I just could not film in a really small little changing room. So instead I just picked a few bits. As I mentioned in the video, I'd already picked up quite a few similar items from H&M. So I was like, oh, I've already bought those. So I don't need to. However, I did pick up the shirt. I tucked it into these white shorts, but I really like it. I've never seen anything like it in a Czech shirt where it's really flattering on the shoulder, like I mentioned, but also like ruched down the middle. This one I got in a 14 and I have to say it does come up very fitted. So I would size up as I did. I would usually get a 12 on top, but it is, I think because of the ruching, it's very fitted for its size and I love it. I feel like it's really nice to put with black leggings or I've just put it with shorts today, which is like a very transitional outfit as we are in too early September, still sunny, but again, not as hot a few days ago in our shopping in London. I also picked up these trusty <laughs> sports socks. I've actually already worn them, but they're amazing. So £3.50, and if you see on like um, reels and things like that, a really nice white sock with a white trainer and leggings over the, these over the top of leggings, then I've gone for these because I've got these last year and I've not washed them with the white, so they're like very discolored, but I got some fresh pair for £3.50. Get three in a packet, so they were amazing for £3.50. And then I also got my trusty pants that I cannot live without. I just went for the same simple black ones to add to the collection. I must have about 100 of these now, but I just love them so much. And again, these ones are £6 for three and they're unbelievable. They are like shapewear without being shapewear. Honestly, they just fit so well. Remember to always size up in these. I like them to be really nice and roomy so that they are higher on the waistband. Into the Primark event, I actually ended up wearing what I was wearing, but then I put on this um, jacket that I ended up actually getting in the 14. I know I mentioned in the video that I couldn't find it. But when I went back upstairs, they had it again. Um, and I picked it up in the 14 and it fit perfectly. I wore it with the black bodysuit from my range, Ella Style, and then the Gymshark black shorts from Whitney Simmons edit. And then I put it with some sandals because I'm not joking, it was so hot. The idea of putting jeans on with this, no, it was very humid that day in London. So I'm glad I picked this up and I'm gonna style this probably in some of my reels and shorts on here with like a hoodie underneath it um, and leggings and just make it a little bit more casual. I'm gonna do another proper Primark call. This was obviously like more of a get go shopping with me. Obviously I knew I had to go to the event. I didn't want to go with like loads of bags. Um, 
and then also I didn't want to get on the train at 9.30 p.m. at night with all those bags. So just picked up crucial items that I wanted. I'm gonna do a Primark proper haul when all the autumn stuff comes in in the next two weeks. So make sure you're subscribed to see that video. But in the meantime, I have got a video coming this Sunday, which is gonna be 15 items that are my essential autumn everyday items that I go to reach to for my wardrobe. But if you are looking for some key pieces to add to your wardrobe for autumn and you're a bit clueless of like what to get, you don't want to waste money on the wrong thing or any trend, then this video that is coming on Sunday will really help you um, and I'll link that down below for you as well after this video passes so thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed coming shopping with me and I will do lots more shopping videos soon thank you so much bye